सो ही गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई विल टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ कंपोजिशन विद यूजिंग गाइस आई यूज जेएस डिस्प्लेसमेंट टेक्सचर सी गाइस दैट्स माय डिस्प्लेसमेंट टेक्सचर एंड गाइस आई क्रिएट ब्यूटीफुल कंपोजिशन लाइक दिस गाइस आई शो यू माय फाइनल रेंडर सी गाइस दैट्स माय फाइनल रेंडर एंड दैट्स माय वर्कस्पेस राइट नाउ गाइस आई टीच यू हाउ आई क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ कंपोजिशन so guys create new new yeah and guys delete your all assets so first of all guys i'm going to take a plane this one and increase plane size guys all size this one like 10 10 yeah right and now guys go to on object and change to edit mode and right click guys use subdivision and guys select your subdivision number of cuts guys i increase like 10 and one more time subdivide it so i like 10 yeah right okay so now guys this time go to on modifier and use subdivision surface for more smoothness guys render i like 4 and level viewport is one is good for fast viewport working okay so now guys again i go to add modifier so use displace this one yeah and guys create new yeah guys stand i like 0. Point, like 2 is good yes and go to on texture this one texture property and open guys i have js displacement texture see guys that's my js displacement texture right so open image yes good and guys now i change also uv so mapping and guys repeat x i like 2 and y i like 2 yes right okay so guys go to on here strength i like 0.3 Yes, and level viewport like two is good. See guys, that's my simple displacement. Okay, so guys, next one, next object I use this time torus. Yeah, and torus segments increase. Guys, take like two hundred, and segments like hundred. Yeah, and radius like one point five. Guys, I take randomly number like zero point six. Yeah. See guys, that's my torus, and guys same apply firstly subdivision surface. So guys render I like four viewport level two is good, and one more time displace, and guys go to create new, yeah, and strength I like zero point, guys this time three, so go to on here property texture property open. Guys, apply same JS displacement texture like this, yeah. And guys, mapping X one I like three, yeah. And change UV this one, guys. Directional this one coordinates I use UV, yeah. See guys, that's my torus, right? Okay, so guys, select this torus and guys duplicate. Press Control C and V. So go to an up. And scale size decrease. Guys, that's my simple abstract art shape. Right? See. Okay. So, guys, that's it. So, next one, guys, I apply my beautiful tree. So, guys, go to one file and append. Guys, I have three D tree model. So, this one, guys, you can download this three D tree model. Guys, link in description. So select and append. Guys, go to object. See, guys, that's my tree. So append. Yeah. See, guys, that's my tree model. So little bit up like this. Yeah, it's good. Right. Okay. So now, guys, I apply tree light. So append and see, guys, that's my light fill. See, guys, that's my area light. This one, right? Okay. So next one, 
guys i show you my simple render like this see guys that's my tree beautiful tree right okay so now guys i apply color for this one dear displacement texture guys i show you my color see guys that's my js displacement color texture i show you how i create this type of texture so go to on here and guys go to here js displacement texture and guys create mapping yeah so now guys go to on colorize and use any color this one see guys and save color okay guys i already saved this one texture now guys go to again blender and this time guys go to shading yeah and guys workspace little bit increase like this yeah okay so now i select this one plain texture and create new material create texture so guys select this principal press control t yeah and apply color texture so guys i have texture this one and import yes but guys see mapping is not correct so mapping guys i use 2 this one scale size 2 and y1 2 yeah see guys my mapping is now fixed right okay so next one guys i create metal effect so metal i like one and roughness like 0.314 yes see guys that's good okay so guys now i also apply dotted grid texture so guys select your texture this one this one and shift d guys copy okay so now guys go to add and use color and color and and guys close so guys select this texture and color and connect and this color and connect with emulsion yeah and now guys i change texture so click on here that's my second one emulsion texture guys i apply dotted grid texture this one i show you my grid texture see guys that's my dotted grid texture right okay so now select and open yes and guys also change color guys color i like orange color like 0.024 and 100 actually 0.024 and 1 yeah and guys go to on here scale size increase like 5 and 5 yes and guys emission strength i like 20 Twenty, yeah, and guys, that's so much visible. Guys, hide this visible. So black color. Go to shift here and position like this. Yeah, see guys, that's my simple color codes, right? My just displacement texture is finished. Yeah, good, right? Okay, so now. Guys, I apply simple light. So, guys, go to on add and light point light. Yeah, and guys, select this point light. So, go to on here. That's my left side. Guys, I increase light strength power like two thousand. Yeah, and radius like zero point five. And guys, color I like blue color zero point six and one. Yeah, and guys, go to render. Yeah, that's my render preview. Little bit up, yes, right. Okay, so guys, now select this point light. You can increase also radius. Like one is good. One and duplicate this light. Press Control C and V. So go to on here and light color, guys. Change. I like orange color. Guys, go to on here zero point zero two four. Enter. Yeah, really good, right? Okay. So guys, select this one. That's my torus, and create new material. So guys, simple white is 
good. That's my white color. And metallic 0.2 is good. And roughness like 0.4. Yes. That's my torus. And guys, select this one and apply torus material like this one. Yeah. Right. Okay. So now, guys, all is good. Guys, next step. I apply SDR image. So guys, go to on world property, this one and color use environment texture. So guys, open guys. I have SDR texture. See guys, that's my SDR. So open image check. Yeah. But guys, this time strength, this one strength. I like 0.1. Yeah, that's it guys. Right. Okay. So now guys, I show you my render preview. Yes. See guys, that's my render preview. Right? It's good. Okay. So now, guys, this time I apply one more plane for lighting. Plane. Yes. And go to on here. Little bit down. Yeah. And guys, go to on plane. This one. That's my plane. And apply ammunition material. Ammunition. This one. And color, guys, same blue color, 0 0.6 and 1. Guys, strength, I like 100. 100. Yes. And guys, yeah, position is good. And duplicate. Increase scale size like this. Little bit down. Yeah. Good. Right. Okay. So, guys, now duplicate this plane. Press Ctrl C and V. And apply on here and little bit off yes and guys color change this time orange color yeah and one more time guys copy and scale size little bit down yes right see guys that's my composition and one more time render preview yes right okay so now guys go to this time select this one that's my plane and duplicate press ctrl c and v yeah select this one plane and guys rotate guys rotation change like this so rotate like 90 yeah and go to back yes so guys go to up yeah see guys that's my composition right it's really good select this one select this one and go to back shift yes okay so now guys my that's my composition is really good and i take camera so guys go to back and go to up guys rotation like 90 and 0 and 90 yeah and guys press 0 yeah and guys set your camera angle so go to back guys i change camera focal and i like 35 yes see guys that's really good and again go to on here like guys tick 12 yeah and little bit up and guys go to back yeah see guys that's my camera angle it's really good okay so guys now i apply one more light point light so guys go to on here point light and up yes go to on here guys strength i like 500 that's my point light 500 yes and color guys use blue color like 0 0.6 and s i like one yes and guys duplicate this point light and press ctrl c and v go to on here and change guys only color like orange yeah so guys press zero for camera preview and render yeah see guys that's my beautiful render right is low resolution render so now i stop this render and select this one plane guys select this one plane 
and duplicate press ctrl c and v guys i change also position position yes and select this one yeah go to on here guys scale size change little bit up yes right and guys select this one that's my orange plane orange material plane yeah right okay so guys again go to render preview yes and now guys go to render setting guys i use ev render guys viewport is good render like 1 to 8 and guys now mb occlusion check bloom power check and surface check yes see guys that's my final beautiful render guys you can also change this bloom effect guys like bloom like bloom and intensity change like 0.04 is depend on your work but i like bloom effect right okay so now guys my final composition is really good and lastly guys i apply area light so guys select this light and point light this one and duplicate press control c and v so up and apply on here like this yeah and yes guys again render preview yeah good see guys that's really good lighting so again press zero much better i select this plane and little bit down yes yeah beautiful guys right see that's my final composition right guys you can increase this subdivision surface viewport level like three is depend on your system configuration yes much better and select this one and viewport level like three right and guys most important part save your project yes okay so guys see that's my final one and guys i show you my final render so like this see guys that's my final render right and that's my final tutorial okay so guys that's it my final tutorial is finished it's looking really realistic and beautiful render so guys if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you